onto the floor. Onto your knees if you can. If you need to, place a pillow underneath your knees. We're gonna do some hinges with that upper body. So my arms are gonna hit 90 and down. 90 and down. And as I hit that 90, I'm gonna take it, I'm gonna reach my shoulders back and then pull it to center. Reach those shoulders back and up. So from shoulders to knees, I'm in one straight line. Opening those thighs, activating that core, squeezing that glute. So in a perfect world, you make a, a 90 degree triangle, your shoulders get right on top of your heels. And up, two more, two, belly in tight. And one, and now take it and hold it back right here. My shoulders stay, I drop my butt. Drop it, lift it, drop, lift. So when you come back to that lift, you're in that diagonal position, that hinge. If you want extra, you take it and leave it right by your ears. Valley tight. I don't know about you, I got all the crunchies. Doesn't have to touch the heels, but you're lowering and lifting for four, three. Those thighs should be burning. Two, and one. Good, pull it in, shake it all out. Roll out those hips. Here we go, we're gonna put that weight to the side. Don't get rid of it, you're gonna need it in a second. We're gonna pull those hands right into those shoulders or underneath those shoulders and just give me curled toes Lift those knees. Rocking push up. So push back, push forward. Knees can tap, knees can stay hovered, but the goal is that your spine is parallel to the floor, whether you're rocking back or dropping down. You can go between knees up and knees down. Two more like this. Good, now take those arms, open them wider. So now you're wider. Still find that lifted knee, but curl your heels so that your heels are touching. Now more like a frog. Frog and push. Frog. Squeeze, four, three, two, and one. Good, take it down, shake it all out. Coming back into your tabletop position, grab that weight, bring it right in between your hands and center those knees underneath your hips. Opposite arm and leg. Reach out and down. And out and down. And if you want, you take that weight with that reach. Now, do not fall in to the flexibility of your lower back. Long body lines, tight core, shoulders down. Good, four. Three, two, and one. Bring it center. Extending your right arm and your left leg. Hold it. You're gonna open side and center, and side, and center. If you want, you have that weight. You can pull it into your shoulder. You can extend it out. Remember, this is about balance just as much as it is about arms and legs. So keep your shoulders and your hips square to the floor, that belly tight, and avoid any crunching. Yes. Good. Try to move your arms and legs evenly, Ruby. Yeah, there you go. Two more. Two and one. Take it down. Switch it up. Belly tight, left arm, 
right leg. You can go 90 degree angles. You can go full extension out and in. Remember, the further your fingers and toes are away from the midline of your body, the more breath and more core you have to use. So use it. Four. Three. Two. And one. Take it down. Turn that, or put that weight to the side. If you have a band, grab the band. Place the band in between your legs, or I'm sorry, on the outside of your legs. It's going to go right around the meaty part of your calves. And then, if you have a ball, grab the ball. You're going to take the ball, put it at your lower lumbar, and then roll down into the floor. Curl your tailbone, pull that belly in nice and tight. Take those feet, and now open them to where you feel that band start to work. Belly is in tight. Teeny tiny open of the thigh. Open. Open. So you should have already felt that band giving you resistance. Now you got to push a little extra. Open. Open. And now to add to that as your thighs open, can you lift? Lift. So two major muscle groups are starting to work together. Feel the sink. Find that Synchronize it. Can't find the right words today. Squeeze. Belly in and open. Ground those feet. So the opening of the thighs should help in the lift. Feel that working together. Four. Chin away from chest. Three. Two. One. Grab the backs of the legs. Scoop and sit up. Good, take those legs, extend them out. So find straight legs, find that resistance against the band, open it up. Grab the ball, place it in your hand, use it as a gauge. Shoulders down, belly tight. Scoop and roll halfway down, reach it up. So keep fighting those legs, open and up. Scoop, now as you scoop, Scoop and pull the ball to the floor and up. Scoop and tap, reach. So the belly has to round and then you add the twist. Scoop, tap, up. Scoop, tap, up. Squeeze, if you wanna add a little extra, scoop, reach the ball all the way up. Scoop, big reach. Belly in tight, up, scoop. Did that, did those legs move? Open that band. Can you suck out the belly a little bit tighter? A little bit lower. Belly in, last set, here we go. Scoop, and last one. Good, take the ball, place it behind your head. Lay down into that mat. Take those feet. Keep them in that band. Shoulders down, legs up. Knees are over top of your hips, so don't pull them in too tight. Keep them right over top. Gently open, open, close, open. If you can, arms up. And each time you open, I want you to try to squeeze your lower spine down into the floor. So I'm gonna turn off the music for a second so that you can hear this. As you open those thighs, feel your entire spine imprint into the floor. So if I were to put a piece of paper under your lower back, I could not pull it out when you're opening and closing those legs. So deep imprint, press your head all the way into the ball. Can you give me four and three? And two, and one, good. Now extend your legs up, shoulders down, away from your ears, chin away from chest. Arms can be up, they can be down, they can even be over your head. Can you lower those legs a couple inches? Now keep wide legs and circle right leg on top, circle left leg on top. Inhale, 
and exhale. Feel that cross of the inner thighs, that belly in tight. Outer thighs are working to push that band apart. Feel that rotation like there's an axis in between the two legs. So they are just revolving around.